Okay, pupils, listen up and listen good, because I'm now going to show you how to safely use a scalpel. First thing to notice, this scalpel, this blade, has a sharp edge here and a sharp point, so we need to be very careful that we're using it correctly. Before you do any cutting, you're going to put a blue mat down, okay? Have your card ready, and you're also going to need a ruler. This is to help you do a straight line. The way you hold the scalpel is like a pencil. It's got this grippy area here. This is where your fingers go. So I just hold it like that with the point down. All you do is lean on the paper, put it against the ruler, leaning slightly into the ruler, okay, and drag it back. You might need to go two or three times. I'm going to go three times just to be sure. If I have a look at that, look at that, it's gone straight through. The only time you might not use a ruler is if you're doing curves, in which case you just have to be really careful, make sure your fingers are out of the way, and you just slowly change direction as you go. Now, again, you might need to go over your line. Again, you have to be really careful. It's easy to make mistakes when you do this. Okay? I'm applying quite a bit of pressure to do this. Again, it's gone straight through. Nice curve there. What you do not do is hold the scalpel upside down. And you do not put your finger, never put your finger over the blade. If it happened to be upside down and I started using it like that, my finger is going straight against that sharp edge. Wrong. Hold it like a pencil, drag it back. The other thing I don't do is grip it like this. I've got no control if I do that. I can't even see what I'm doing. Also, look, this blade, it bends quite a lot. If I bend it too much, it's going to break. So, always hold it the correct, correct way, drag it back, use a ruler as much as possible, bloom out on the table. Be safe, be blade aware. Adios.